No, 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 no. Stop. Can you, can you, can you, ladies and gentlemen? No. Yeah. Welcome to episode twenty-four. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty-four. A uh, Metal Gear Scholar. I'm your boy, Baby J. Joined by the killer sun himself. Chips. <laughs> so I'm joined by Sun Chips. Mr. Sun Chips. <laughs> and Carmine. Combined with the crinkliest bag of all time. Mm. Uh, can we hear from the crinkly bag? Uh, Whoa! Chips, language! <laughs> language. Crinkly chips, crinkly bag. You gotta fucking, you gotta fucking telecopter up now? So, what helicopter? Oh. You ready Have you seen this whole cutscene yet? Why do you call me brother? Brother? <laughs> Did you hear his response? Uh, brother from another. I'm pretty sure that's one of his clones, right? That wasn't his response. He was like, "Guys, because it'll be close." He didn't, he didn't fucking break it down for you, like language. No. Yeah. Our youth audience is uh, gonna get YouTube warnings. I know. All these inf all these very influential children watching this M-rated video game, which really should be rated for kids nowadays. I heard we're Greta Thunberg's favorite YouTube show. How dare you! How dare you! No fidelity! Well done. Oh, yeah. These some shit stink. Which ones are they? Hardest Shedder. Harvest. Those are amazing. Not hardest, harvest. If they're the harvest, if they're the hardest Shedder, <laughs> you might have plus action <laughs> <actual laughs> monster. It's the hardest Shedder I've <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, 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 he can shoot me through that, but I can't shoot him? The bullets have fidelity. He has better fidelity. <laughs> wow. Yo, this shit is old school. <laughs> the developer's like, you know what? Fuck you! No, actually, I think the managers were like, we don't got the budget for that. Do you have any more Cheetos left? Can I switch? No. You don't fucking bag of Cheetos? They're puffed. Well. <laughs> That's what they think. Puffs. Oh, and then I see Cool Cat. Cheeto Man. I understand. You can have my bag. Didn't ask for him, but I'll leave. <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen, that is the classic interaction between older and younger brother. <laughs> yeah, no names, no familial relations being disclosed. I'll tell you one thing, this is some hard It must sound like a couple of fucking Dago bastards for the past three and a half years didn't tick you guys off. No ethnicity, no names, no familiar relation. And no description of our geographical location. Right next to oh, the massive... Yeah. Right off of exit nine. <laughs> we well, you got to this level of health uh, quicker than ever. Oh... Oh. You could do it. You could do it. Health wise, proportionally, he's doing worse than you. Oh, shit. And he's an helicopter. We learned anything from Afghanistan and Vietnam, boys. He did blow up all that bullshit that was in front of you. Was that a question or was So you can't shoot over the south side of the tower now. What? He blew up all the bullshit that was blocking you on the south side of the tower. Yep. So when he's on the south side of the tower, you can shoot him now. Adorable? Adorable. Oh, it's a little cat and mouse. Like, oh, I'm hiding from him. I'm in a big hunker. I'm hiding. Don't hurt me, Silver Snake. I just play. I'm pretty sure this is Silver Snake right now. Silver. So, this is the reason why you have to do five episodes in a row. Heating up! Oh, yeah. 
for our next performance, I lick my fingers very close to the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, this is what is the ADSM thing? What? Ah, uh, that hard cheddar is fucking terrible. Could you? Could you not? Oh. Oh man. You still got it. You still Licking got it. When he's flashing, you can't do it. Yeah. So you're neck and neck. Double stuff. It's almost dead even. Oh, big. If he keeps eating those chips, he's gonna be triple stuffed. Oh, baby. <clears throat> North. Guys, you know, I have an issue with sodium levels and bloating. Oh. Oh. Am I gonna keep blowing myself up there? I can only hope. If that, hey, every time you died, because you decided to. Just didn't want to be here, boy. You sound like my coach. <laughs> what were you playing there, Carmine? Rowing. Your rowing coach. That's a pretty rough rowing coach. Somebody had to tell you how to. <laughs> yeah, you fucking lose. He's like, yeah, yeah, it's here. <laughs> all right. Yeah, that's why. We, that's why we dragged our ass out of bed at 4 a.m. Yeah. in the morning. That's one thing I never understood about uh, the good old crew teams is they felt the compulsion to wake up at 3 o'clock in the fucking morning. As if the lake wouldn't be there after sunrise. <laughs> oh, that lake traffic gonna prevent them from rowing and shit. You know, <laughs> it got too choppy. You have to get out. Uh, you have to get out early so the wind doesn't pick up. I see. So the, the wind, wind has a time schedule now. Yes. Oh. Yeah. I'm <laughs> sure they were rowing on Lake Superior, where the the waves were gonna be really, really, you know, just interfering with their. You'd be very surprised. Good lord. You'd be very surprised. Be. It's there. hard to work on form when the water's choppy. Who was the coxman in your boat? Um, we had two guys that were like five foot two. Five foot two coxswains? I don't know, we had one, we had, uh, two girls, so three of our coxswains were like five foot two, and one of them was my friend who was like five foot nine. Too big. Oh, yeah. <laughs> big old coxman. And they just basically told you to stroke every two and a half seconds? The coxswain? I stroked the big black Johnson. Really? Not a joke. That was your rowing partner, or, uh... <laughs> no, no, that was the name of the boat. Oh, okay, okay. That was just walking with the boat. I was stroke, and the boat was the Big Black Johnson. Man. That sounds exciting. Oh, it was fantastic. If I had known that in college, I would have signed right up. Took that, I took that race to completion. Did ya? Took my time, too. That's what my coach was so upset about. <laughs> yeah. Under some context, great. Thing. The way that I had learned. Yeah. <laughs> You know, it is kind of shitty. By committee? Indeed. How they make you start this boss fight with your key card. Because you can't get through that door without your key card. It's a true story. Comfortable but furious, Come. Be able to know. I moved out. I moved up. I moved out. Yeah, we are just going to win in the. Uh, Conor McGregor fight. Not Conor McGregor? Conor McGregor's fight? Apparently. Not to take this fight, but we're not going to say who's going to fight and uh, which version of the fight it might be. That's right. That's right. But I predict he will win. Do you? I do. I think Why? he's going to lose. I predict he'll win. That's because you've never seen him win. You're an unlucky charm, and we're going to write to him about it. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. He's going to show up. Man. And then um, I'll get to be Conor McGregor. I've seen <laughs> I've seen him win once, 2016. And yeah, you were in a different country. Yeah. Oh, uh, different cunt. 
tree. That's right. Not on oh, yeah. It's a special kind of tree. Big old cherry <laughs> tree. <laughs> it's a special kind of tree. <laughs> Find a dummy. North. North. All the trees North. in this country are awfully hairy. <laughs> so much, so many bugs too. Never in season. Oh. Never in season at all. Uh, oh, what the. The folks. Yeah, fruit's never ready to pick. <laughs> there we go. That's the end shot that uh, oh. Baby J's been talking about all night. Indeed. Put that banana around his tailpipe. Put the banana in my tailpipe, man. <laughs> like, this is the double stuff. Talk about bananas and tailpipes. Come on, man. All night. Who does that? But I'm a tip up. Shoot, man. Can you do any other Eddie Murphy uh, famous lines? How do you know? Movies? How do you know that was Eddie Murphy? I mean, it, it sounded just like him. I thought he was in the room with me, and then I looked over. and I saw it was double stuff. Uh, yeah, double. And then, and then my dreams. I was giving him my script for uh, fucking Beverly Hills Cop 2021. No, Norbit Two. Oh, I see. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Because if there was ever a remake. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one we gotta <laughs> remake. <laughs> that was good. That blockbuster. <laughs> Here we go. Flying below the rail. Dirty bastard. And just to warn you folks, just in case you haven't seen you didn't look at the timestamp before clicking on this video, I'm not gonna stop recording until this is done. Oh boy. Well we got the coffee brewing, so. Let's see what happens here. You're pointing right at his ass. Is he just out of range? That's unfortunate. Oh I have faith. You have to eat that. <sighs> Run be alive, get some help! No matter where you are, he always shoots at that wreckage to your uh, south position. It's almost like it's scripted. No. Oh, shit. Shoot him now! Do it! Do it! Kill me! I'm you! Nice. Point blank. That is one See, now, now he's not saying shit, he's being surgical. He's nice with it. Nice. He's sick with it. There we go. Stay first person, baby. Woo! Stick and move. Yeah. Too easy. First person. Uh, not as much. There you go. First, first. Oh, yeah. Woo! Shit. Ah. 
bottoms. Nice. And again. Oh, oh, babe. Yeah, baby. There you go. There you go. Let's mess that one up, boys. Uh huh. Stay first person. Stay ready to rock. Or at least whenever you're in position. Shoot him there? Nope. Don't even try it. Fidelity. Fidelity man. No, 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 no. If you get hit him, he can hit you. Oh. Locked on. Oh, he, 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 he turned too much for him. Alright, a little more left. Okay. The thing to remember here is you can take one more hit than he can take, and that rock will fuck up your day. If you shoot it at a wall next to you. Yep. <laughs> nice. Whoa. Well done. Right in the needle, sir. One more hit. He's no help left. Pure victory? No, that's pure. Aha! Uh -huh. Wait, how did how did you just blow up the entire area and I lived? Because you're a cool mission, cool guy. You're a cool guy. You thought he was dead though. Oh wait, wait, wait. Because you had an you deserved it. You deserved it. This episode of Metal Gear Scholar. How would you feel about that one? Actually, let's talk to let's talk to Anakon. You want to talk to Anakon? No, I want to skip through this. Like a proper cool guy. Whatever this is. Talk to me about that boss fight. And to the place I belong. Let's try to get the cardboard box. Where's Virginia? <laughs> <laughs> my mom. Uh, just gotta just gotta stand stand over here. Take me home. Oh, smoke a little cigarette. You know I deserve this. That's pretty good. Kneel down. Like a true Japanese Brain smoking man. Like a Japanese smoking man? X-Men. X-Bot. X-Bot. There you go. 
Oh. Like a proper cool guy. This is gonna be the thumbnail. I love it. Mm-hmm. Just hold, just hold it on this pose for like a good ten seconds, so then the YouTube thing will make it. They'll be like, "You want this one?" Yeah, I hate that crap. Can we stop that? What? Little windows that pop up on YouTube right before the video ends when I always have my big exit, you know, my big moment right before the video cuts out and it blocks the screen. I mean, I really feel like it's, you know, killing the vibe overall.